Hello everyone, welcome to the Garage Theatre and episode one of Tommy Fogo Superhero. I wanted to show you some of the set before we get going. Here we have a smoke machine, a bubble machine, a perspex container, some bottles of water, ah, some food colouring. This is an old fashioned overhead projector and here we have some little bits and pieces, a tiny little cello. And a loop station, and over here, a cello stand, a bus conductor's cap, something furry and beardy. Let's take a look over the other side. Here we have a pink feathery crown, and a rucksack, and a funny square hat, and some chalk, and a teddy bear money box. Some little clues and hints along the way. I'm just going to set this camera up, then I'm going to become Tommy Foggo and we are going to get going with episode one of Tommy Foggo's Superhero. Here we go. Let's set this up nice and even. Lovely. Okay. Give me one moment to become Tommy. See you in a bit. Ladies and gentlemen, molto grande, molto piccoli, a tutti frutti with chocolate sauce, sprinkles, and extra nuts. Put your hands together now for the world's first multi-talented musical superhero. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, here is Tommy Fogo! Please give me a drum roll, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Here we go. That's it. That's wonderful. Keep it going. Yes. Thank you. And a very warm welcome from myself, Tommy Fogo, superhero. And from my strange and alien sidekick and hench honcho, the wooden but very wonderful. Yes. Oh. He's a little bit shy. Could you please give me another drum roll, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? Here we go. Keep it going. Oh, that's brilliant. And from the wooden, but very wonderful. Yes. Hmm. Excuse me, one moment. Look, we've been through this before. I just want you to come out onto the stage and do the thing that you're... Oh, oh my God! Oh, my God! Right! You... Right, you are for it! Oh, no! from my super equal, superhero partner. A totally awesome superhero in his own right, with his own megasonic superpowers, the world's first wooden and metal, but in no way like some string puppet or cheesy robot superhero. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, give it up for Destino Da Cello! Destino and I have come here today to tell... No. To 
share with you an adventure to bring to life here today the extraordinary story of how we became a superhero duo diving Wrestling, a monster of the deep. And finally, hey, what's your favorite flavor? Ice cream. Yeah, you in the front row. What's that you say? Chocolate. Oh, let's do this properly. Mm -hmm. Bucket for ice cream. One scoop of chocolate coming right up. Oh, look at that. And madam, what is your favorite flavor ice cream? Mango. Very classy. Let's make it a big one. Here we go. And sir, what is your raspberry ripple? Oh, wonderful, here we go. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, a triple scoop gelato. Can you please all show me right here, right now, your very own triple scoop gelatos in your hands. Yes, that's it, with, uh, with sprinkles and uh, extra nuts. What's that? Of course, chocolate sauce, how can I forget? Here we go. Coming right up! Look at that, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. <laughs> what would you do with it? What's that? Eat it. Well, come on then. Show me. Here we go. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I want to try. Oh, yours. Mm -hmm. Pistachio. Mm -hmm. Mint chop chip. Oh, 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 yes. Now, where was I? Oh, yes. <laughs> Wrestling a monster of the deep. <laughs> and finally, devouring a whole bucketful of Italian ice cream. Oh, something tasty to look forward to. Just as well. Because we have to get through a ton of sad and scary, tough and terrifying bits before we get there. It ends, like I said, in a bucket full of ice cream. It begins on one of those long, hot summer's days when I was... Excuse me. How old are you? That's right, you. What's that? Ten years old. It begins when I was almost exactly the same age as you. It was just after breakfast and I was sitting in the hot and stuffy time out, think about what I've done wrong and be ready to apologize room in the children's home where I lived then. But what I was actually thinking about was sweet Cold ice cream. Like you do when you're hot and sticky and don't know what to do with yourself. Phew. Just imagine it. So hot you can hardly breathe. And you're stuck indoors about ice cream that you can't have one. That's it, Destino. That's exactly what it feels like. Such a
Come on, everyone. Think. I say cream. Here we go. The sun, sun, Sweet and sour, sad and happy mum. Because it was on that exact same day, just three years before, when I was... Excuse me, how old did you say you were again? When I was almost exactly the same age as you, that I lost her. And that's why I ended up in the children's home. And this is how it happened. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, that is the end of episode one of Tommy Foddo's Superhero. Join me next time at the same time for episode two.